beautiful. Don't cry. <laughs> you look so good. I love it. You really like it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good now. <laughs> <laughs> this was what you were nervous about. Yeah. <laughs> My loves, the day we have been dreaming of and worked so hard for is finally here. We made it. I've been restlessly excited this whole time, but now I feel a sense of calmness. I cannot wait to see you walk down the aisle looking more radiant and beautiful than ever before. Knowing that I have the honor to become your husband makes me the happiest man in the world. I fell in love with you the moment I stepped off the plane when you came to pitch me up. Seeing your smile was one of the most beautiful sights I've ever seen. I fell in love with you at that moment. Every day since, my love for you has only grown stronger. I could never imagine I would ever love someone so much as I love you. This life we are growing together is only going to get better. Today we become husband and wife, but this is only the beginning. Here's to the first day of the rest of our lives together. I love you, Tristan, to infinity and beyond. Love, your hubby, Logan. Logan, today is so beautiful in every way. Because after all these years, I have the privilege of marrying the man I could have only jumped of. It all started with a grade school crush, and who would have thought that we'd be standing here today ready to say I do. Logan, you carry yourself so well. Have a grace about you that only those around you can describe. Every day I experience life with you, I fall even more in love than the day before. I still have to pinch myself that this is a real life and that this isn't a fantasy. I never knew I was capable of loving someone as much as I love you. You've become the most important person in my life. From the hot schoolboy I once knew, <laughs> to the most fantastic friend, partner in crime, hall parent, <laughs> firefighter, lawn mowing, bodybuilding extremist you are. This day only solidifies what we've known for some time. You're my best friend and we will do everything together from this day forward, one step at a time, one moment at a time. Thank you for choosing to spend forever with me. I promise to try to be more patient when I'm with you, to always chase your dreams with you and beside you, and to make decisions together. I promise to choose to love you and to always choose you. Happy wedding day, my love. I can't wait to spend forever making every moment feel this good. Love always, Kristen. Logan, take you, Kristen, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and honor you all the days of my life. Logan, take this ring as a sign of my love and fidelity in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Over the past four years, we have watched how deeply Logan and Kristen care for each other. We watch them grow together and support each other. There is no doubt in my mind that they will live happily ever after. Marriage is a journey. It has good days, bad days, and some Toledo winter days. But always remember to be the first to forgive. Remember the feeling of today and your commitment to forever. Cheers to how we do, Logan and Kristen. It's very difficult to summarize Kristen in a short speech. Our bond is 24 years in the making. But what I can tell you, especially Logan, is the type of person that I've had the absolute pleasure of calling my sister. There are so many qualities about Kristen that I admire, namely her protectiveness, creativeness, fearlessness, fashion sense, and determination. 
Logan, I can tell you without a doubt, you could not have picked a better person to share your life with. After a few short months of them dating, I realized that Logan was Kristen's soulmate. I mean, if they can survive a 36-hour car ride across the country in a two-door Mustang with a dog, after only dating a few short months, then they can definitely survive marriage. It's been a pleasure getting to know you as an individual and as the perfect partner for my sister. There's a time where Kristen told me that she felt that she would never find love. Thank you for loving her the way that she deserves. The one thing I can tell you both is to just love the hell out of each other. There will never be enough moments in life to say I love you, so take advantage of every opportunity. Please raise your glasses and join me in a toast. Love is a force that's more impressive than any other because it's invisible. It can't be seen, but it can transform you in a single moment and it'll offer you more joy than any material possession ever could. Cheers to Logan, Kristen, and love. Drink up the tabs on my parents tonight. set a goal and you will not stop until you achieve it. And that goal changes quite a bit throughout the you know 12 years that I've known you, but it's cool. So like right after college, he says, I'm going to go be in the Navy. But, all right. That's something that you don't just decide one day to do. It's a hard thing to do. There's a lot of training, a lot of time, a lot of effort. It's a big commitment. And then what happens? Two years later, he's out in California. He's in the Navy living it up. Um, a little more recently, he decided to be a firefighter. Again, not something you apply for on a Monday and start on Tuesday. My favorite one is he decided he was going to be a bodybuilder. And the very first time that I met Logan, he was maybe 110 pounds soaking wet. Um, if you would have told me the things that Logan Howell might have ended up as, bodybuilder would have probably been 9,872nd on the list. But what happened, he puts in the time, puts in the effort, and a year later he's on a stage, he's a bodybuilder, he's holding it. So, and then that obviously leads us to the one that we're here for today, which is, comes to us one day and says, you know, there's a girl I've known for a little bit, and we're getting a little bit more serious, and I'm going to marry this girl. And here we are. So, I think probably the whole point of this is that, you know, I think if he's decided, Kristen, that he's going to make you the happiest girl in the world, and he's going to be the best husband that he can, then it's going to be on that long list of things that he doesn't stop until he accomplishes. So, with that in mind... Everybody can raise their glass. It's Logan and Kristen. I present to you, Mr. and Mrs. Logan Powell.